All right, let's do this. I heard you the man to see. So look, I need you to take care of this guy right here for me. Victor Flynn. Good evening. Power 5 News at your service. Right, right, Power 5 News. Man, you got a good operation, man. Placating as a newscaster who happens to break the major death stories first. Got to get these ratings. And for an extra two million, I need you to take out the sister too. Hmm. I think we can get it done. But first, let me have a lengthy deliberation with my colleague. What say you? She did. Lock in. Pressing. Pressing. Huh? Press. You find the man who uh, did this. You what's bring your him relationship? to justice. Come on. Do math. Rillo and Jesse in the Detroit Memphis Connection. What is going on, y'all? Back here again with your ultimate predictions pack for the finale of Power Book 4 Force. We are finally here. Uh, but before I begin, make sure y'all comment, like, and subscribe. Lock in with the DMC here. Let's go ahead and get into uh trailer here. And then we're going to get into these clips. Vic, I got some more energy for you, sir. Not yet, though. I'm going to save it. I'm going to save it. Vic is terrible, man. <laughs> right. First don't fuck your bitch in the click you claim <laughs> Victor Flynn, like what is this? All right, we're we gonna get the Vic, we're gonna get the Vic, but first, let's get to JP. JP wants blood, y'all. He wants to know who did this. So, what you think JP gonna do in this episode? I, I, he's probably not gonna leave the hospital, he's probably just gonna stay there the whole time. So, I don't know if we're gonna get any dialogue between him and D Mac. Uh, I did a uh like a theory video yesterday uh, about what happens when this dude wakes up uh, from the hospital or whatever. So uh, are, are they going to be going into business? You see uh, JP wanting D-Mac to get into the business. what you think? Uh, it's when D-Mac wake up, I don't see him locking in with JP. Look at me. It's JP. You're going to have a lot of animosity for that dude. But that's what I think when he wakes up. Uh, of course, they're gonna want to get him off the streets, him and uh, and Tommy. But we see where this is going, man. He that's all he knows, so he's not going to, you know, go to school or <laughs> he's not going to be enrolled. <laughs> right? <laughs> D Mac is coming to Stansfield. No, nah, he's not no. be enrolling. Uh, he's gonna be still in the streets, man. So the best thing is to go under Tommy's wing. Now, what is JP gonna do? Wouldn't it be refreshing if JP actually got his hands dirty? Wouldn't that just shock us? Mm. Wouldn't, wouldn't you like to see something like that? But they're not going to yeah. give us that. Nah, he ain't going to do JP, that. JP, you know, caught a body. <laughs> like, that would be crazy, right? Right? I mean, yeah. he do got the Egan blood in him. He, I mean, it's not going to happen. That's not my prediction. What I predict JP to do, stay in the hospital, doing nothing, with a mad face, like somebody owe him something. You looked your own son in the eye with a baseball bat in your hand and said and didn't know anything. Didn't even recognize him. Right. So what's my prediction? JP just going to be JP, sit on his ass, and do absolutely nothing like the Whole sucker bunch of that he is. <laughs> Period. The man's a sucker. Fuck! <laughs> All right, JP. All right. <laughs> let's move on to the next. Now, General Tommy got a hold of the Serbian army. So, um, do you see uh do you see them working well together? Uh is do you see Murkovic possibly, you know, um I guess back during Tommy? Yeah, I mean, come on, man. That that is the you can if anybody could see that. Like, if, first of all, that line was cheesy. It's your army, but I'm the general. <laughs> what? You the general, like car insurance? Like, come on, dog. Like, <laughs> what are you the general of? Like, of course, Murkovich 
is going to backdoor Tommy. He's already working with a, a Flynn, I think. <laughs> I think he's already working with a Flynn. I know we're going to get to it, but of course, Markovic is going to backdoor him. Everybody going to see that. Well, he should. It makes sense for him to backdoor him, right? Right. So you know what that I'm, means. I'm, I'm still having a hard time. They not, like, they might not how can you let this slide? You know. Exactly. How? <laughs> I mean, Tommy has single-handedly killed at least 15 to 20 members of your organization. How can you be a leader and let this man slide? All right. Next up. Did Claudia truly sip the Kool-Aid? Because we get we hearing some rumors that Claudia yeah, might think, uh be doing the back door. Yeah, I'm kind of mad I didn't. It makes sense, so it makes me think that it's fifty. I hope so. It would it would help, wouldn't it? It would really help. It didn't make you so will be redeemed, man. <laughs> Pete, this is what I've been thinking. So I rewatched it. <laughs> <laughs> so look, so when she was following Tommy or doing whatever she was doing, I'm thinking she following Tommy. But what if she was going to meet with Murkovich, who she already had to deal with, mm. told where to kill Vic? I mean, she looked pretty comfortable going during wartime, going to see the man who just put a head out on yeah. her brother. She looked pretty comfortable. And when she saw Tommy, she looked like she saw a damn ghost, right? She looked shook. Yeah. And that's when she runs and tells him that Tommy's behind it, thinking that Murkovich is possibly out in her, right? So now you might yeah. as well go to war with Murkovich. Because before that, she was telling Vic, like, it's not Tommy. I work, you know what I'm saying? She knows it's not mm -hmm. him. She was telling everybody. Why would she have that change of heart? So I'm hoping that's what it is because that will actually help. Yeah, it, it just, the last episode just seemed totally out if of her character. The, so. Right. If she got the mask, it, the, it did, which is leading me to believe that that is true. If they leave it like this, it makes no sense. <laughs> like, seriously. <laughs> All right, let's move on to Liliana and the chemist. We must protect this house. I'm so, concerned. Are we concerned for the chemist or are we concerned for Liliana? Well, you no, know, I'm not concerned for the chemist. She's dead. She's dead. Oh, she's out of here. Oh, you might as well hit that button. She dead. <laughs> uh -oh. she <laughs> Where it? She dead. She is done. The chemist does not serve a purpose. I'm kind of worried about Liliana. They might put it. Mm. They might just end this Dahlia stuff. Hold if that chemist, thought. If the, if the chemist <laughs> and, uh, and Liliana die, Dahlia is over. Hold that thought. I got a clip for that one. But let's move on to your guy, Diamond. Will Diamond do something in this episode? Something. Uh, I actually think he going to, yeah, yes, I'm going to say it. Right here on the last prediction pack, Diamond will do something. He going to do something. I think he going to lock in with, he going to actually help Tommy. Because okay. he know he sees his, his gang is against him. He don't know who to trust, but he know Tommy is is too official, too thorough to, to snake him. He know Tommy is 100% true G. A man of his word, he know Tommy not gonna snake him. So I think he is gonna uh lock back in with Tommy um and help him some kind of way. Yeah, that could happen. But personally, I think this scene, I, I think he might be uh uh pointing his gun at Janard. I don't know. If he got if they do this, if they have him kill Janard. And have the looking Claudia like he's making a tough decision, right? If they have the Claudia thing happen with her being the mastermind and working with Murkovich to lightweight try to kill her brother, because remember, uh, Gloria said that you worse than your father. If her father, the devil, Gloria says she worse than him. If they give us that and have Diamond, uh, at least attempt to kill Jannard or shoot Jannard. That would that, that would be a lot towards making this series uh uh go mm -hmm. up a grade and making us anticipate are we finally right. gonna salivate <laughs> for the next season? If they if right. they gave us all these BS episodes and on the last episode we're salivating, licking our fingers, ready for season two, then they did it, then they did their job. 
They got one shot. If we wait, if we if we can't wait for season two, they did their job. If we watch this last episode and we still like, oh man, I liked it, <laughs> but it didn't really make sense. I'm, mm. Like, you know what I'm saying? I might be done for six months, <laughs> right? <laughs> Until season two come out. Well, hell, longer than that. Probably six months is probably for raising Canaan in book two. So. You know, book four is yeah. way out there. If that's the case, you got an outside chance of making this correct. You give me some unthinkable stuff. I mean, some like Diamond needs to do something crazy like that. Even though I don't want Jannara to die, I mean, I wouldn't be too mad if DV did, especially if Diamond did it, right? Because that would just turn Diamond into a, a, you know, what I'm saying, a demon. We need to see that part. <laughs> All right, let's move on. Why is Walter so serious? This dude, like, he he wants to, he, he acting like he got stage four cancer. Like, right. He should be getting chemo. Like, or they should have made it. Like, like why doesn't he have a, a higher grade of cancer? I know all of it's bad. I'm not you know, diminishing anybody's fight with cancer. But I'm saying, like, he has a, a high, per- a high percentage to live, but he's just acting like he's not getting treatment, not getting surgery, and then it seems like he he just wants to put Vic in position to take over, like as if he was like had, was terminal. That's what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. I know cancer is cancer, but he's acting like you know he's terminal. I don't get you know, it. He might he might be scared, man. <laughs> Looking like he having second thoughts or something. He's supposed to be the devil, man. Do I want to do this. Like he Look should be wondering who really put the hit. Back door me. <laughs> no, nah, he think he he's dumb because he's thinking it's Tommy Tommy Egan. What would Tommy stay in the game? Like you, right? <laughs> so like, that's why I hope they 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 got a lot of work to do in this episode. Man. I hope it's longer. Usually, sometimes finales be longer. I don't know. I haven't heard anything. Yeah, yeah it might be a little longer. All right, moving on. Showdown at the lab. Vic got the horseman. But before I go, Vic, it's it's I got I got some more words for you, sir. Look, you talking about I, I don't have the clip, but y'all saw it in the trailer. He's talking about we gonna do it for Gloria. Look, this what's gonna happen. When you and Tommy see each other one on one and you looking down the barrel of a gun, Tommy is gonna say this to you, sir. That's why I fucked your bitch. <laughs> That's what's gonna happen. <laughs> Let's get you up out of here, man. Vic's gotta go. You definitely gotta go, man. I just, I hope they. I honestly, my what I, I'm saying, I'm, I'm trying not to say what I want to happen and really make a prediction. What I want to happen is Vic needs to needs to go. He doesn't serve a purpose. Claudia needs to be doing that double play. She does serve a purpose. She could be a, a potential uh, opposition for Tommy. This looks cheesy right here. This is not MI-13 or <laughs> Mission Impossible. Like, why do they look like it's a scene out of Mission Impossible? I want that street, gritty edge. They didn't need all those accessories, man. Just hey, all this tactical gear y'all got on, y'all better take somebody out. They, they looking like they uh, uh, Navy SEALs or something. Like, come on, man. <laughs> Horsemen, y'all better earn that name. They about to be the two horsemen. Cause I'm <laughs> guarantee you, Tommy putting a bullet in one of them, one of their heads, quick. They might all get killed. You know how power like to make people mm-hmm. look look out. They might get killed easily. They don't really know who they messing with. Are we yeah. finally gonna see Tommy some pressure on Tommy? Where it's life or death. I think so. I think so. I'm getting to it. Were we thinking like, man, who is Batman? <laughs> what? I'm, I'm looking at this hand right here. It looked like a black hand, but where? Circle it, cause I don't see it. Like, like right at the top. Look at the tip of the bat. Oh, like the color of the hand. That's too big. <laughs> <laughs> If they give me, oh man, 
And it's look like it might. Is that Tommy place? It look like his apartment, maybe. Uh, that's diving. It's yeah, diving. Could be. Diamond gonna be coming. We're gonna think it's a hit, and he's gonna be like, Yeah, I'm locked back in. Janara trying to kill me. Oh, he's trying to kill you too. Uh, he's trying to okay. kill me too. <laughs> Your brother gotta go. That might be the hard conversation that they having. Yeah, Diamond, you have to potential to have another brother, a white brother. Might need to uh knock Janara top off, even though I like Janara. Well, since we're talking about that. It's time for the real fight for the CBI. Not not the fake fight. The real that Janard? No, that ain't Janard. I know no. that's that's Blackston. That might be yeah, Janard. That's Blackston. It looked like they kicking that door in. Yep, that's that's definitely the barbershop. Yeah. I mean, once I Diamond let it be known, buddy off guard or what? Once Diamond let it be known that he heard or whatever. Then maybe they they're applying pressure to Diamond. All righty, what do we got next? What we got next? Got that already? Do we have a family reunion coming up? Whose house is he at? That's what I'm looking. Because this look like JP house. So my only the only thing I'm gathering is that Kate might be showing up. He he, had, he went up the pistol on Kate. I don't know. <laughs> 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 That's the only thing I'm getting from this. But it looked like I, JP house, though. Yeah, that could be. I don't know. It does. I was going to. No, that name definitely ain't Claudia. Uh, nah, he wasn't up to piss on. He might have. He might. He just <laughs> might. Uh, she be, she gets to talking too crazy. He might pull that pistol out. We might see that crazy time. He did have that look. Yeah, you know what? I think you might be on to something, brother. Because you know how Kate get if she get to talking crazy and say something like it should have been you and not go, it should have been you and not Jamie. He had pulled a right. gun off of her ass. Got the, got the whole got the family back. Got Tommy, Kate, and Ghost. All right. Will Murkovich oh. join the fight? This dude is he gonna so have whack. a body. <laughs> he better have no, he is whack. He is a whack leader. As much as I'm rooting for Tommy, I'm rooting for him to be back during. Like he need to be trying to do something. That looked too like go back to that scene. That that, that could be him just I don't know, just showing off a good look like something. target practice or something. He don't look <laughs> yeah, like that. He's yeah, coming yeah. in the background. He just letting off shots. He probably showing Tommy the weapons. Like, yeah, we have this. Yep. Not putting in no work because there's no urgency in the background character. Like you just standing right. there. Okay. They don't look like bullets are flying, but you just standing there looking goofy. Right. <laughs> well, Murkovich will do nothing in this episode. <laughs> nothing as usual. All right. Next up this is the one I want to talk about. Will Tommy? Take that L. Who is He's that? Grunting, like screaming about something. This looked like that Liliana in front of him. Damn, man. That's what I that's what I've been saying. I'm worried about, man. She might be done. Nah, bro. Did she get shot? <laughs> I think she might be done. Is her nine lives over with? Yep. Liliana <laughs> is a goner, man. Don't do it. Don't do it, power. Please. You know why they're gonna do it? Because we don't want them to do it. <laughs> right. That's why they're going to do it. Liliana is probably going to die. And she oh, already survived. <laughs> right. She didn't already survive. He, JP or DMAC not dying. Tommy don't care about nobody else. He haven't had no losses this whole year. Right. Liliana done survived the beatings, shootings, and uh, torture. Mm. He cares about nobody else in the entire Chicago. JP, D Mac, and Liliana. And we know D Mac and JP are not dying. Right. So in order for Tommy to take an L, she has to die. She's probably going to die saving him. Yeah, because think about it. She's going to bullet for Tommy. 
somebody on Tommy's side got to die. Somebody. Right. Now, you see, uh, he ain't got nobody on his side but those three. So And the chemists don't count. <laughs> That's she a modern already body. Dead. She dead. She gonna die in the lab. So that means Dahlia is dead. Over oh, with, yep. And that's a good thing, too. We don't need that goofiness all over the other because Dahlia is goofy, bro. I'm sorry. The, the way they did it, like, you know, it's it's a good concept because a new drug, you know what I'm saying, make make a name, but the way they overplayed it, well, I don't if Liliana dies and the chem one or well, the chemist might not die. If they go mm. keep the dahlia around, man. What you yeah. think? Um you think, I do think Liliana is out here. She 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 might die protecting the <laughs> chemist. I don't know. <laughs> she might die protecting the chemist. Uh but yeah, Liliana is out of here, man. I don't know oh, about man. the chemist. The chemist has to live then because they have to be able to unless JP. Knows the recipe. That's too um, much. That's right. too much. I mean, he did start cooking it up, and she did say he got a lot better. He was he was uh going going basically he was his whip game was getting real good. Mm -hmm. So that's leaving the door open for JP to have a bigger role. But uh, you know, Liliana is a goner. I don't. I, I don't. I hate. I I really don't want them to do that. But that is why they're going to do it. None of the friends are going to die. This is my real prediction. It's not what I want to happen. None of the friends going to die. Uh, so, something going to happen with Jannar. I don't know if he's going he gonna to die or either go to prison. Um, Liliana's going to die. They're going to leave it on the cliffhanger of exposing that Claudia is the mastermind behind the shit or whatever. Mm-hmm. And that's it. We're gonna be look like it. It was a seven, eight. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? No whole slabs over here. But yeah. we'll see. I could be wrong, and some of those predictions that I want to happen could happen. Yeah, you look like you answered my next question here. My final clip is Walter's time over with. <laughs> oh, I forgot. Walter. Walter might die. Yes, Walter's gonna die. Because Claudia is going to take over. Claudia taking over. I see Paula right here. Do you think Paulie might be a part of that takeover? Uh, I don't think Paulie definitely don't want this war. So I don't think he has really nothing to do with, with this aspect of it. But he's definitely going to be working with, uh, with, the, with the kids, of course, with his uh, niece and nephew. Yeah, because he's brought it up multiple times. You know, the kids of the future, basically. So he he's a different type of thinker than Walter, anyway. Yeah. So, well, all right, that will do it for this predictions. But the final predictions pack for now. <laughs> so, um, make sure to catch us Sunday, uh, one o'clock Eastern, twelve o'clock Central. We will be doing the first reaction for the finale. Uh, so, anything else you got? Uh, I saw you got the uh, the old dog versus uh, Bishop. Yeah, that's gonna be. Yeah, I, I don't know where that's going, man. <laughs> I don't want to cop out and say a drop. I can, I really can't call that on Friday. I'm gonna have to make a decision. I'm gonna need some help with this one. <laughs> we got old dog versus Bishop from Juice. They are similar characters, and I don't know which direction I'm going in. Who was the hardest? Who was the most gangster? It's probably the hardest one. All right. Well, uh, anything else you got on your channel? Uh, just Friday, dropping opponents, and of course, uh, you know, Saturday, the DMC. And uh, oh, snowfall tomorrow. Snowfall. <laughs> snowfall. <laughs> <laughs> snowfall tomorrow and if, if you catch this you might get this uh snowfall prediction real quick with your predictions pack real quick leon gonna die tonight leon x that's mm. my prediction leon snowfall x. prediction you get extra on the pack this week leon <laughs> is dead this week 
Yeah, I know I pulled that out the blue, but hey, that's how the DMC get down. Leon will die this week because I don't see him killing Big Unk yet. Um, that will make Franklin, you know, that will that would make Franklin actually want to kill Louis and 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 his uncle if they mm. kill Leon. Okay, and she's the reason, and Leon is always in the hood. You know this botched hit. They about to kill the hell out of Leon, man. Leon is 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 the general of the projects. He's the only person that's in in the projects, you know, getting his hands dirty. So he's at risk. That's my little extra, little extra gram for you. If you catch you heard it here, Leon X will die. And Liliana. She did. I hate this. I hate to say it. I hope not. I hope not. <laughs> I hope I'm wrong. I hope I, I really do not want to bring Power Five on here, y'all. <laughs> All right, but that's gonna do it for this predictions pack. Make sure you drop y'all theories down below. Comment, like, subscribe to both channels. Me at the Jay's Review and Brillo at Brillo the Big Review, and we'll see y'all guys next time. Peace out. Peace. Brillo and Justin the Detroit Memphis Connection.